feature in the title. Mm -hmm. Hey everybody, this is Will McCormick at Burt Wolf Toyota. Just wanted to take a minute out and, and help people out who maybe been having a problem with getting their phones paired and showing you all the extra connectivity with the new uh, Intune audio system. It's all touchscreen and interactive with your phones. Today I've got a, a, my phone, which is an iPhone 6 Plus, and uh, we'll take a minute here and, and get you walk through the basics. On the screen here, first thing we're going to do is select Bluetooth audio, and it's asking me to pair a phone. So that's the first thing I want to do. So what I'm going to do also is go to my settings menu, pull up Bluetooth. It's already on. I've got a few various ones here from other pairings I've done. So I'm going to hit yes. The phone is automatically looking for the phone, for the uh, truck when I go into trying to find it. And there it is. We're in a 2016 Twin Tundra TRD Pro right now, but it's the same system for all of our Intune pairings. So it's the same exact operation. So it says pairing was successful. That's how quick and easy it was. Now there's one more step with the iPhone, which is very important. And that's where it asks here for operate device to allow messaging services. So when that comes up, if you have an Android system, it'll give you prompts on your phone, which will do this automatically. And I'm going to hit ignore right now on this because it's wanting to pair up my Intune. Ordinarily, you would hit allow and accept it and have the Intune uh, app downloaded already. But rather than go through all that right now, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the Tundra where it says connected. I'm going to hit the little blue eye for information. I'm going to hit show notifications. And what that did is it allowed the, the uh, messaging services to come through. I'll go back. I'm pretty much done with that now. I go into here. Bluetooth audio is up if I want to go through that. don't want to hit anything right now for that. What I want to do is check the phone settings. So I'm going to hit phone. Wait for all the contacts to come up. My phone could take a while. Just about all my customers are already programmed in my phone. <laughs> Alright, so now it's all it's all paired up. I'm gonna hit the button here in the corner, which was the envelope, and now it's gonna ask me if I want to set up messaging. Well, I've already allowed it on the phone. So now I can hit yes, wait for it, and it says I'm connected for audio player as well as phone and Intune. So now if I go back in here again, message list is going to populate. If I would have had an Android phone, it would have been pre-populated with all of my existing text messages that would have been on my phone and just poured them off right over. But since I have the iPhone, uh, it's going to wait until I get my next message after pairing for it to populate in this field. Once it's up, what it's going to do is allow me to have a chance to hit read or ignore when a message comes in and if I just hit read the system will read it back to me. It's really that simple. If you have any questions feel free to call me. The cell phone number is 304-437-WILL. That's 9455. I'm here at Burt Wolf Toyota just about every day. Give me a call anytime. Thanks a lot.